We're here today with Jackie from 360 Gearboxes. Now, Jackie, I've heard a rumour that adding a turbo to a non-turbo vehicle can cause a problem with the manual gearbox. That's correct, Simon. Here is an example. We have two Land Cruiser gearboxes. This is a factory turbo model. This is a non-turbo model. And as you can see, there's a clear difference in size. This is clearly a larger, stronger gearbox. The input shaft bearing here is probably one and a half sizes larger just alone, and that's just the first bearing. Synchros are also larger and stronger in the turbo model? Correct. This is a first gear synchro in your turbo box, and this is the first gear synchro in a non-turbo box. So people who are thinking of adding a turbo to a vehicle, do they have to swap gearboxes or can they upgrade to strengthen their standard box? Because there is a considerable size difference. Correct. This particular gear train we can upgrade. This gearbox here has a 1HZ motor. This can be modified and strengthened, but some models you can't strengthen the gearbox. So is it just adding a turbo or any power upgrades? Any power increases, but turbo obviously probably the biggest one that we see. And people adding a turbo, you'd see a lot of them. What sort of damage is done to these gearboxes? We see pretty much damage throughout the whole gear train, but predominantly third and fourth and especially fifth gear. The biggest thing we see is that the turbo boost is set on maximum and this poor little gearbox just won't stand a chance compared to the factory made one for a turbo. So the advice to our viewers is if they're thinking of fitting a turbo to a non-turbo vehicle, all said well and done, but think about your gearbox upgrade as well. Unfortunately, we hear only too often where a customer is told that adding a turbo to their motor will have absolutely no impact on the rest of the vehicle. But as you can see, Simon, there's clearly a big difference between the size of a non-turbo gearbox and the turbo gearbox. Well, Jackie, a huge insight. I'm learning about gearboxes myself. Thanks for all the information. I look forward to catching up with you next time. Thanks, Simon.